Now that the virtual world's interface is loaded, let's take a look at how to choose your robot and which level to use. Then you'll be ready to start running your robot. Inside of the virtual world's interface, you will have to choose from a few options before you run your program. First, go to the Robots tab at the top of the interface. From here, you can choose from a number of different robots to run inside of the virtual environment. Each robot has different physical characteristics and sensor locations, so be sure to check the configuration of your robot before running your program. Next, go to the Movement tab. This section and the other sections contain all of the challenges that are available in the Robot C curriculum products. You will be able to follow along with the curriculum videos and practice the corresponding programming challenge or activity using these sections of the interface. Go ahead and pick the first challenge listed in the movement section. Once a challenge is selected, the menu will show you an overview of the challenge table and also give you the objective of the challenge. You can also click on the Specification Document button to launch a printable PDF with in-depth details about the challenge. With your challenge and robot selected, you're all set to try the activity in the virtual worlds. Click on the Start Activity button to launch the virtual environment. Inside, you'll see a menu with six buttons. The blue Play button is used to start executing your code, moving your robot. The green Return button is used to restart both your robot and your program back to the beginning. You can use the Home button to return to the main selection menu. There are three different camera options to adjust your view in the virtual world. Camera option number one is used to chase the robot from directly behind. Camera option number two provides a fixed, top-down view of the entire level. Camera option number three is used for free movement of the camera. You can control the camera by using your mouse. Click and hold inside of the virtual world window to adjust your viewing angle. You can also use the scrolling feature of your mouse to zoom in and out to adjust how much of the world you can see. Now that you're comfortable inside of the Robot Virtual World software, continue to play around and explore each world. If you would like to learn how to access more worlds, please move on to the next video to learn how to install additional level packs.